Hey guys, what's going on? In this video, we're doing something that no one has ever done, and that's ordering stores from Fiverr. All right, all right, a lot of people have done it, but no one has tested like three of them in the same video, so that's what I'm doing. But yeah, without further ado, let's go straight into the video. All right, so in order for us to order a store from Fiverr, we'll at least first have to find the product, so I'm gonna go on a few really, really tough hours and search for some products. I'll show you them, and then we'll go order the stores, maybe the ads first, I don't know, we'll see. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I guess that means I got some work to do, so see you soon, I guess. Many hours later. Okay, so after scrolling CJ dropshipping, not Drop a Spy this time. Usually I would search on Drop a Spy, but you know, if we're building like stores on Fiverr, it doesn't really matter too much. If you guys want to use Drop a Spy, link in the description. It's really good, but yeah, so I'm on CJ and I found three products that we're going to be testing and having the stores built for. So the first one is an electric like head massager that's also LED and stuff. I haven't seen this product before. It looks really interesting. I kind of feel like I should have seen it by now, but I haven't. So I think this one's actually got some really good potential because it's pretty cheap it's like i don't know we're getting one for nine dollars like less than ten dollars i guess we can sell one for like 35 30 minimum so we got a nice markup there uh, the second product i've seen a lot of times it's this like straight hair comb comb i don't know um yeah we're getting one for like 13 dollars so yeah not too expensive pretty decent i feel like it could sell so yeah let's give it a go and the final one i've seen like similar products i've never seen this exact design it's like an eyelid massager or something like that it's supposed to make you look younger people love looking younger i guess yo guys it's me from the future i just wanted to show you guys one of the stores that i've been working on with a client right so he came to me with a product doing like 300 dollars a day uh, on april the 8th and we partnered up and we managed to scale it to 1k a day in less than like 10 days and then we took it to 2.4k and and we kind of had like a down day then we scaled it up all the way up to 4.5k and then it was doing like really good 4.5k again and then we kind of had to scale down because of like facebook issues and stuff but it's still doing like 1 to 2k a day pretty profitably and this is the main campaign in facebook so as you can see it's done 117 thousand dollars in revenue and we've only spent like 38 thousand dollars in ads so the roas is like 3.09 so if any of you guys are doing like 400 dollars a day or more in revenue and you'd like to scale your store uh, dm me on instagram or email me i'll have my email in the description and we can get in touch and see if we can work something out um or if you just want to get on the mentorship uh feel free to dm me on instagram as well and yeah that's pretty much it back to the video and yeah i also found the products on aliexpress so i can do this so if you guys don't know there's a tool called saturation inspector and it's so good so it's in the chrome web store so check them out i'll have a link in the description as well um but yeah it basically tells you like how many other stores are selling your product and this product seems to be like very untapped it's only managed to find like two stores selling this exact same product and the really cool thing is like it gives you the link to the store so you can click on the link and it takes you to their product page and then you can see if it's horrible if it's good and if it's good you can like copy some of it so it's really awesome for descriptions too if you're like not creative like me then you can come in steal a bit from this guy a bit from this guy and make your own description so all right so for the other product it only found one store selling it so we're doing pretty good we found some unsaturated products and then the final one's probably going to be a bit more saturated because i've seen it a few times um, but yeah, let's see. And all right, it's pumping up 12 stores. All right, so only 12 stores selling this one, which is not too much. So I think we should be safe. It's, we're not selling two saturated products. This site is like, I don't know which language this is. This is something uh, Arabic, I think. If you guys want to check out Saturation Inspector, link in the description. And yeah, so, you know, we have the products. Now for time's sake, I'm going to be ordering the ads before ordering the stores. Just because we're going to be waiting at least like a day or two for the stores, maybe even more. So if I order the ads after that, then we're going to be waiting even more. So so, so I'm just going to order the ads beforehand and then we'll order the stores, I guess. And uh, yeah, that should be it. Then we're going to be ready to go. So we're going with top-notch ads. If you guys want to use top-notch ads as well, I'll have my affiliate link in the description. I think you can use code Marco to save like $5 off. So, so yeah, as I always say, the split tester package is always the best. Yeah, so we're going to be ordering three uh, split testing packages and we're going to be adding the ad copy. So just so I don't have to write the ad copy myself. It's like 10 bucks, so not too bad. Let's add the cart. And there we go. So let's check out nice all right now that i placed the order i'm just gonna fill out the like product submission forms so this is gonna take a few minutes see you guys once i'm finished all right so after a decent amount of time i finally submitted all the forms so i guess now we can finally go to fiverr and find some gigs maybe order some stores and yeah see how they turn out so let's go there all right so we're on fiverr and let's search for like shopify store and let's see what comes up um all right 426 euros that's a bit expensive for one store 18 
Wow, 1700 euros, dude. That's like $2,000 or something. Yeah, let's scroll a bit and let's see if we can find something that's like not incredibly expensive and looks good actually. But yeah, I'll scroll through and I'll update you guys once I found something. So yeah, let's see. A few inches later. Okay, so I think I've found the first actual like listing. It did take a while. Like there are a lot of bad ones, but this one's got 1400 reviews. I think this is like the best reviewed, or, like the highest number of reviews listing I've found. It's a level two seller, which means they've completed at least 50 orders on time with a minimum 4.7 rating if someone's new to fiverr um yeah that's what it means and uh yeah two orders in queue uh the packages it's like 70 bucks 110 bucks so yeah it's not that big of a price difference but you get like 10 more products one more page and you get like responsive designs so yeah premium is just standard with more like products and stuff so i don't know it's probably good as well but let's just stick to standard because i'm buying like three stores and yeah so i'm gonna be ordering from this one now i gotta find like two more that we're gonna be using so See you guys soon. A few moments later. All right, so I think I found like the second person we're gonna be buying from. So the basic package is only 35 bucks, which is like super cheap. Yeah, you get like three pages, 10 products. All right, 10 products is really good, um, but it's not like responsive design, stuff like that. So I'm not sure what that means, but you know, I, I feel like it should be better. So standard is only 70 bucks, so it's not that bad at all. And you get 20 products and stuff like that. So we get, we also get like five plugins here, which is awesome. Uh, it's a level one seller, but like really good rating as well so four orders in queue that's quite a lot yeah i gotta find the next one so see you soon i hope soon after all right so we're on the final one i managed to find like three of them so let's see so the standard again like 35 bucks this i mean the basic so then we have the standard which is the silver package 70 bucks once again yeah we pretty much get the same thing with it on the previous one um we have some examples here that don't look bad at all but yeah well you know we'll see we'll see how he does um i think it's a guy yeah so it's a guy from india and he says he's got five plus years of experience and the reviews are also really good so i don't want to overthink it let's just order these three and let's see how they do all right so now i'm gonna go order all of these three so let's click on continue so yeah let's just check out and i'm gonna link all the gigs that i use in the description in case you guys want to use any of them so now i gotta enter my uh credit card info so i'm gonna go with paypal this time and let's pay now and let's see what happens bam thank you for your purchase all right so we need to submit the shopify url which ends with dot my shopify okay so i i guess i I need to set up the store first so yeah i'm just gonna start the trial and then i'm gonna submit all the info and then if the other two stores need the same thing i'm probably gonna do the same thing there so let's go and we're done guys we ordered all of them um i think he also yeah he needs all the same info as well so i'll just build some stores and i'll give him all the info off camera because it's gonna take a while so the next time you guys see me the stores are gonna be done so yeah see you guys then a few days later Yo guys, it's been like three days or so, I don't know. Like three or four days since the last saw me. All right, so we've got the stores delivered and uh, I've opened all of them up. So we have three of them ready. I haven't taken a look at any of them. I've just come into like the Shopify home and I didn't like check any of them out. So I'm pretty excited to see what we got. So let's check out the first one. It's the Hairstyler Pro. It's the like white product that I showed and bam, we're in. So this looks pretty nice actually wow i don't know how they found all this content because this product was like really hard to find any content for this looks really good actually um regrowth hair care testimonials as well and then we have some like uh how to use i guess the product and then we have uh, this part like the footer so this is pretty nice like we got all these pages and the main menu as well so i think we paid like 110 dollars for this store so i'm pretty pleasantly surprised like with the quality for the money it's looking pretty good like the home page and all the other pages and everything like that like this saves a lot of time if you guys build your stores yourself oof, like this is gonna save like at least five hours maybe even a day and then they also did the description um all right so the description is not perfect for facebook um i would definitely customize it if i was gonna run the product so i am gonna run the product so i will be customizing it and and i was human i am human still um but yeah, it's not bad as like a uh, framework, but I guess these guys are good at building stores. They're not really salesmen. But yeah, this is actually not too bad if you guys just uh, play around with it. Add like a few more photos, some like titles and stuff like that. It, it can actually be a pretty decent description. Then we have like the FAQs, contact us, everything like that. So pretty good. I, I'm pretty happy with this. This is really good if you're doing like a branded store or something, cause it gives it like a branded feel to it. All right, so overall, I'm pretty happy with the first store. Not too bad, like for, I think it was $110 for this one. Pretty good. Um, Now let's check out the second 
second store so let's just click on this thing okay wow this store looks really good damn this is actually really good like this part i really like and then we have some photos of like i guess these are probably stock photos but they look like really good and then we have some new arrivals um hairstyling they even added like more products to the store as well but yeah we have the footer i would just like remove one of these because they're the same and um, we have like our policy which is nice i changed the color of the text to white um just so it looks better because it's hard to read like this especially if someone's like 60 and they're on your site they don't really see this text so i'm really happy with the second store i think this one was like 70 dollars so even cheaper and it looks really good they also both added like some custom themes i've never used these themes in my life so they look really good and then let's see what happens when we go to hair care um yeah they've added like five products here and then hair styling another like five products here as well this is a really popular product so this one's really good i'm really liking this one and then the product page this can be improved a lot yeah they i, I don't think they did any custom description this is probably just what i left so i guess i can't really expect them to do the descriptions because they are only store builders so yeah i'd play around with the colors for sure other than the colors the site looks amazing so really good value for like 70 bucks so yeah i'm really liking the second store and now we're on to the final one so let's check it out and we're in so we got a pop-up Ooh, the logo looks really clean and uh yeah this is also i guess a one product store and wow okay wow this looks really good i'm not gonna be reading all the text because there's just way too much but uh the site looks really good i'm really pleasantly surprised i think this one was also like 70 bucks so for the money this was amazing wow yeah what happens when you click shop now takes us to the product page and all right so it's kind of like structured i guess if we add a few titles a few images and stuff like that we can like make this a pretty decent product page and overall the product page looks the best on this store i'd say yeah i would just slightly modify it and i will because i'm not going to be running like the stock ones i would but i'd really like to give these products a better shot at selling so i'm just going to modify the descriptions a bit and uh yeah well we've seen all the stores they all look pretty good so i guess the ads are the only thing that we need to set up now so i'm really in a rush right now so i'll be setting up the as tomorrow but for you guys it's gonna be a few seconds so see you then okay so that was quick it's the next day today i think i haven't shown you guys the ads so here they are i'm just gonna be talking in the background because you know these take a while to play out and usually i make the mistake of not talking in the background and then it's kind of weird to play them so you know hopefully they're, they're done by now but they're from top notch ads i like how these ones look so like two of the products that i gave them were like super hard to find any content for so i don't know where they found these videos so yeah now let's go set up the ads i have like played around with the descriptions a bit on the sites nothing crazy though i didn't put too much effort into them because i don't plan on running these sites like long term but you know just made them like a bit better just so we don't like totally waste the money on ads because yeah, i normally wouldn't run these products and i'd put more effort into the descriptions but you know i'm kind of curious how these sites are gonna do so okay so let's set up the ads i'm just gonna make a new campaign and we'll start off with like the hair straightener let's just start off with that and then click on continue now you want to name the campaign so let's just do the name of the product um it doesn't really matter what you name the campaign it just matters that like you know what it is here don't touch this and then let's click on next all right so let's just do like five dollar a day budgets since we are doing like three stores don't want to waste too much money and then let's schedule them for tomorrow for the age let's just keep it like 18 to 65 plus for the location let's just do like the top five languages we can leave on all um detail targeting expansion leave this on you can like turn it off but it doesn't matter too much i, I always keep it on and uh for the interest let's just do like hair so hair products for example that's a pretty decent one change the asset name to like the interest name and then i almost forgot to change the gender since this is more so like a female product i've just done women only the placements we could do like manual we could do uh automatic let's just do feeds for now so i've just left like facebook feeds and instagram feeds on everything else i turn off and yeah let's just click on next now we're on the ad level i'm just gonna call it ad create of one i'm just gonna put like the bitly link here so we don't forget and then for the headline let's just do like 50 percent off sale ends today or something like that and the primary text is what really matters but i did get the ad copy from top notch ads so you can write it out yourself too i just like prefer them doing it because it, it was easier and yeah i'm just gonna paste the link twice just like that and there we go so we now have the ad copy everything is ready so let's just put the call to action to shop now now i'm just gonna click on publish and there we go we're ready so let's just go to the ad set level now we're gonna make like six copies and just change the interest now i'm just gonna manually like change each interest and i'll update you guys once i'm done and bam i'm done we have like seven ad sets ready so i'm just gonna go repeat the process for the other two products and i just realized i forgot to add in like the other creatives so yeah, that's gonna take like a few minutes too but uh i'll just update you guys once everything is done and uh yeah so see you then all right so i've finished setting up the ads for all three of the products and here are the interests that i went with these are the ones for hair styler pro and then these ones are for bell eyes and yeah so now that we're all done i'll update you guys 
guys in like 24 hours or so once the ads have been running for a while and we'll see if there's any potential in these products and yeah so see you guys then tomorrow all right so it's been more than 24 hours since the ads started running and i do have some good news and some bad news sadly we were not profitable overall but i was expecting that it's unrealistic to be profitable on three stores especially like on the first day of testing with three different products but we got one sale so the sale came in from hair straightener pro and that is this website so it's a website we bought from this person on fiverr and i have to say i'm pretty happy with the results and then the other two products got no sales so i turned off all three campaigns because i don't plan on running any of these products but i wasn't really expecting these to be like super profitable because the products themselves are not the best but we did get a sale so obviously the stores work and i think with a bit more testing and stuff like that we could make this profitable and yeah so in conclusion is buying a store on fiverr a good idea i'd say yes so if you guys are beginners or you're looking to build a brand or you're doing a niche store or maybe you're like too busy or working your job and you don't have the time to i think paying someone on fiverr like 70 bucks 100 bucks or something like that is not a bad idea at all as you can see um the stores look really good so as long as you're good at selling and you find good products you have good ads and everything like that you will be able to make it work so so yeah in case you guys want to use the exact listings i used in this video i'll have them linked in the description i'll also link all the apps and services that i've used in case you want to use any of them yourself and uh if you guys want to get in touch i'll have my instagram and email on the screen and yeah that's it for the video i'll see you guys in the next one peace yeah.